Good morning and welcome back to Deer Valley Homestead. My name is Andy. This week we are getting rid of our chicken area. The guineas, they're gonna stay here and have their own little area separate from the chickens. We have also been very busy doing a bunch of other stuff. We have finally finished the wood storage area. We have replaced a small wooden house on the roof. I don't know the right name. So this is what is left of our garden. We have a couple of tomatoes to harvest. The plan for this winter is to move the chickens here. They're going to come down here and they're going to pick through this, kill off all of the grass, all of the weeds, eat all the seeds in the soil, get rid of some of the bugs. And in doing that, they're going to fertilize it as well. And then when it comes to April, May time, we'll just rotivate the soil. For that to happen, I have to move all of the blueberries, blackberries,
Buena. Okay, well, that is our new chicken area ready for the chickens. However, I'm not gonna try and catch all the chickens during the day. I'm gonna come and get them tonight once they go into roost. They're so much easier to catch. And we'll show you that now. Okay, maybe two, okay. Yeah? Yeah. That's why, we, that's why we move them at night because they're just so much more peaceful and easy to catch. Poof, 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 poof. Hmm. And do your chicken dance.
As always, thank you very much for watching. We hope to see you next week. Don't forget to like, comment down below, and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Quick check in with our wildlife camera. We had a new animal that we've never seen before, and that is a cow that has been terrorizing the local village. I've seen the farmer on a number of occasions trying to find this guy, but he seems to like to stop by at night. We had this young fawn, and this fox come in for a quick check. I hope you have a great week, and we'll catch you next time.